on a fundraiser for the IOF or the IDF who are responsible for the genocide in Gaza and in the West Bank. We're here to protest blood on their hands to say no to money for genocide, to say no to money for the destruction of Palestine. Look, they want to arrest me, right? Um, if you're new to my station, I am the Hebrew Widow, the Hebrew Rose of Jericho, coming at you with some judgment news. Shalom, all my sisters and my brothers out there of the Star Seed United, allies and friends. I sent you infinite love and light, and I receive yours, Abracadabra. Ooh, you guys, we are getting so close to our total redemption. We are getting so close to the synagogue of Satan, who say they are Jews and are not, coming down before our feet and worshiping our Father. Ooh, we. Yes, yeah, so now what we got going on here is a protest of Donna. Karen, okay. Now, back in the day, I had a lot of Donna Karen in my wardrobe because, you know, it was conservative, it was well made, and, you know, I just liked her, her fashion. So, she's been around a long time, honey, and we didn't know who she was, but now we do. Let me tell you, honey, these people are losing big time over this war all of them all of them okay <laughs> now i seen something i think i spotted i spotted somebody here now it may be him and it may not be him but it sure do look like big mouth jonathan green black jonathan is that you is that you look at him yeah, the ADL guy. Yeah, <laughs> you're surrounded. You're surrounded by empathy. How does it feel? This is what empathy looks like, you guys. Empathy is not just, um, you know, feeling the sorrow of someone else. You actually feel it. It's like you have a passion. And I told them, I told all them spies out there that the energy on the planet was going to morph on their asses because, see, you got empathy plus anger. Yeah, and this is on a low level. Still, nobody got hurt. Nobody was hurt in this, you know. It was a little aggression. Let me tell y'all, as this war ends, as Satan Yahoo, or Satan Yahoo, excuse me, as he continues his shenanigans with those little Nazi soldiers over there, this energy is going to quickly morph and people are going to start getting hurt. I'm just giving a warning. This is, this is something that is going to happen. <laughs> it's going to happen, okay? So, we got Donna Karen, famous, rich, and wealthy, Jewish fashion designer. Yeah, I didn't know that she was Jewish, but you look her up on Wikipedia, you see she's one of them too, who say he, she is a Jew, and it's not. So, what she's doing is a fundraiser for the IDF. She felt that it was necessary to invite all of her rich and wealthy Jewish friends to an event to raise a lot of money so that she could reward those little bastards over there for what they're doing. Yeah, that's what Donna Karen did. And because of that, Honey child, Donna Karen is her company is going to flip flop because she's going to be added to that BDS list now. Oh, we and everybody in attendance to reward those little demon bastard Nazis over there called the IDF. See? 
all of her rich friends. I'm sure they have companies too. Ooh, and if somebody get a hold of that guest list, y'all are in trouble. Y'all in trouble anyway. See, this happened once before. In Florida, Governor DeSantis, he raised money for Daniel Penny, who unalived our little brother. Jordan Neely, yeah, and when he did that fundraiser, if you go back and look at that video, we went to the courts of the Most High for that fundraiser, and we asked that everybody, I don't care if they gave a dollar, that those finance angels, angels just go in and wreck their finances, and what happened to the economy of Florida was the result of that curse for anybody that blessed our enemies. Yeah. So we have a whole group of people that are 3D elites that attended. See, only 3D elites could attend such a party to raise funds. And I imagine there's a few from other nations. You know, like Al Sharpton and Charlemagne. Kamala Harris, maybe even Candace Owens. And Secretary of Defense, of course, Lloyd Austin. Yeah, there was others from other late nations. But let me tell you, that room full of narcissists. Yeah, those wicked ones that don't have not one molecule of empathy. They are all cursed right now, and it's nothing they can do about it. Nothing at all. Let's go back to this protest because, you know, we, we just have to savor the flavor of our victory. Yeah, this is all a part of our victory. If somebody got a hold of that guest list, which I'm sure that it, it'll be easy to get a hold of. Yeah, all of y'all are going to be wrecked. All of your finances, yeah, even if your your stocks, whatever you had, if you attended that meeting, ooh, just be ready. You're going to take on great losses, great losses, because see here, in this particular fundraiser, let's see, when, in, in this particular fundraiser, it was for the synagogue of Satan to raise funds for the synagogue of Satan from the United States of America to the synagogue of Satan over there in Israel who say they are Jews and are not but do lie over here in the United States where they call themselves Jewish or a kind of Jew trying to take on our name as Judah Okay, and so we have people out, out here that's not at all afraid of that word, that slanderous word, anti-Semitism. We defeated the magic of that word, Star Siege United. Let's give our father praise and glory. Give your mother adoration and pledge your allegiance to our big brother Messiah. Ooh, he is turning this world upside down. <laughs> Honey, that energy of empathy and anger scared the bejesus out of the attendees. Let's look how they try to scramble out of there. Okay, so see the popo? They're going to the back door. Ooh! <laughs> Synagogue of Satan is trying to sneak out of there under police protection because of this energy that's outside the door. Watch how they come out, y'all. Watch this, watch this. Is that a paddy wagon they're getting into? Honey, they do not want to be seen. That horrified these people. <laughs> one of them in a hoodie. <laughs> Wasn't that beautiful though? I'm sure they arrived in their limousines and they're leaving out in a paddy wagon. <laughs> 
these angels are just so poetically funny. Yes, the way they're taking down our enemies. Oh, wait, they're being destroyed from within and from without. Their economy and them being the leaders being taken away from them, you guys. And it's happening very rapidly. Brace yourself, brace yourself, Donna Karen, because you're going to be added to that list. Your name is already out there, child. Yeah, you might as well just give it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the stocks are going to crash in your company. Nobody's going to want to buy your label any longer. You see, we talking about old money here. Donna Karen's been around a long time and had all kind of stability. Well, that just crumbled right underneath her feet because of her deeds. Yeah, all of that empathy out there destroyed her company. Yeah, and when they get that guest list, everybody there, yep, all y'all stock, stocks are going to crash and your stores are going to close because you chose to support those little demon Nazis over there and Satan Yahoo over there doing a genocide and it's nothing you can do about it even though this is Star Seed United they are trying okay so you see this BDS right here this is a list of companies that support Netanyahu and Zionism and I imagine most of their CEOs have the same pro profile as Donna Karen and they're already crashing so they went to the White House again. They went to the White House. Okay, and they created an anti-boycott act. Does that make any damn sense? Do these people actually think that they can punish people if they do not spend their money in these Zionist companies? You see... Okay, so this is what we've recently learned. Okay, at least I recently learned that laws have absolutely nothing to do with what's right and what's wrong. These lawyers, yeah, most of them coming out of Yale, some of them coming out of Harvard, like Michael McCall. Yeah, his network is actually almost 300 million right now. Yeah, he's very wealthy. And uh, he helped to form this anti-boycotting act. How in the hell do they think they can control people uh, with the fear of being arrested or being called anti-Semitic if we don't spend our money in these Zionist companies? They are going against people's uh, constitutional rights with this one. I mean, they going deep with it. They're going deep with it. And they already have the capability of spying on you and seeing where you spend your money. So if you're avoiding these companies on this BDS list, then you'd be targeted for what? They're going to punish people if they don't spend money in these companies. You know, it just makes no sense at all. Yeah, all of them are going to fall down because now laws don't have anything to do with what's right and wrong. It has everything to do with what? Power seats decide as a rule. And then when it becomes a rule, then it's punishable, you see. Yeah, so, and then, and then in the same token, they say that they want to sanction, uh, they want to sanction uh, 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 countries that use human shields. Now we know who they talking about. And so they want to sanction everybody in support of Palestine that they call Hamas. Yeah, terrorists. But they're been, now they're being called baby killers and stuff. People ain't afraid of that word anti-Semitism. They call them all kind of names, calling them out. Yeah, so they should know by now that going to the White House... Counting on all of those seats that were purchased by the ADL and APEC that rule the votes, even though you got a, what was it, 42 to 3 or something like that, that vote was to pass this ridiculous law to go against people's constitutional rights. Yeah, that's not going to work for y'all anymore. Star Siege United, you know what to do. 
first, we just want to praise and honor our Father for all of his promises. For they are true and amen and they will happen. Hallelujah, Father. And to our beautiful mother that we adore above all because that's what our Father does. Yeah, we give you all admiration. Yeah, and we thank you for all of the wisdom that you have given us on our holy mission, connecting us from this 3D dimension to the 5D, guiding us to our Father's most holy courts to plead our cause. Today, we just want to give thanksgiving because, Father, we see where you are turning this world upside down. You're turning the economy upside down. Ooh, hallelujah, Father. And we just want to thank you today. Yeah, we see your great and mighty works. And you have made us, Star Siege United, more than conquerors. Taking down principalities, powers, and spiritual wickedness in high places. Thank you, Father. You put the power back in our hands. Yes, we're just waiting for that day where the world will recognize that we, the Hebrew children, the people of the book, the children of Abraham and Sarah, your children, mother and father. Yes, hallelujah. We see it coming where the world will know that you love us. Yeah, and we're looking forward We're looking forward to our new positions on our thrones. Yes, hallelujah. Yes, all praises to the Most High. And we pledge our allegiance to our holy kingdom, the kingdom of love and light, the kingdom of this world, where our big brother, Messiah, rules. Yes, we salute you, Messiah. We pledge our allegiance to you. Yes, (laughs) Yes, and we see it. We're witnessing it. And we're making a record of it. Thank you, Father, for our record of victories. We are more than conquerors, Star Seed United. Give your Father praise and glory. Yes. As we leave these most holy courts once again. Oh, we, Father. Bless us. Strengthen us. Yes, increase the energy that you put on this earth. Let there be more empathy. Yes. Hallelujah. Okay, Star Seed United, allies and friends. That is what I have for you today. And if you resonate with this message and you're new to my station, join in the fight. Subscribe. Yeah, and join Star Seed United. Your energy. Join with my energy. Going to those most holy courts have have been very effective. We have many victories under our belt. Yeah, congratulations, Star Seed United, for joining in this most unusual, strange fight that Mother has left led us on. Yeah, hallelujah. Okay, you guys, hey, have the best day of your life. May goodness and mercy follow you all the days of your life. Yeah, hallelujah, so that you may dwell in the house of the Most High, Yahweh forever. I love you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share all of this good news. Doesn't it feel good to fight back? Yes, we are very victorious. Thank you so much for your support of this station and all of your kind gifts of love. They're much appreciated. Yes, and may the Most High bless you. 100 fold for whatever your hearts desire. Have a good day. Okay, you guys, until the next judgment news, your big sister, the Hebrew widow, the Hebrew rose, and Jericho out. Shalom.